Could this be the year medical marijuana becomes legal here in Kentucky? Lawmakers are considering it this session, but there has not been a vote. Good evening, everyone. I'm Doug Profit. And I'm Lisa Hudson. However, that's not stopping a local group of supporters from making their voices heard, even though the governor is promising a veto. 11-11's Robert Bradfield is live tonight downtown outside Metro Hall with a look at the latest push that includes several Metro Council members. Robert? Yeah, that's right. There is bipartisan support, at least among 10 Metro Council members who are co-sponsors of this non-binding resolution urging state lawmakers to pass a medical marijuana bill. Tonight, the first of three town hall meetings scheduled in Louisville to discuss the possible legalization. Call it a community conversation about cannabis. I medicated myself with marijuana for 35 or 40 years. Believe me, it worked for me. Inside Linden City Hall, shared stories of how marijuana helped calm or eliminate certain medical conditions, including from Myra Mitchell's son, who did three tours in Iraq. When they return, they find themselves not knowing what is wrong with them. Her son was diagnosed with PTSD. She says his world came crashing down after his return. Mood swings, depression, and a divorce. But doctors medically prescribed him marijuana, and she says his lifestyle changed for the better. All of these, these characters, these uh, being upset constantly, and not playing, all of this change. But some are still on the fence, weighing whether legalizing medical marijuana would do more good than harm. I just want to kick the tires, all the tires, and make sure that, that I uh, come to the, the right reason conclusion. State Representative Jason Nemus hasn't made up his mind about a current House bill that would legalize medical marijuana. He has reservations, but also hears stories similar to Mitchell's son. It's important for me to hear uh, what citizens think, not only because it educates me, but it, but it allows me to, um, to have some questions that I have answered. It's an issue that's reigniting a debate, some believing it's about public safety, while others argue it's about their health. Now, House Bill 166, which would legalize medical marijuana, is currently in the Judiciary Committee. Governor Matt Bevin has warmed up to the idea of possibly allowing medical marijuana. However, he says he would veto any bill that would allow for recreational use. There are two other town hall meetings scheduled throughout Louisville next week. We posted that information along with the date and time, along with this story on WHAS11.com. We're live downtown tonight. Robert Bradfield, 11 at 11.